And Jesse in okay, Virginia. Thank yep, thank you much. Uh, and Jesse, do I don't want to read out your question. Uh, j go ahead and read it for me. Uh, um, uh, can you hear me? Yes. Hello? Awesome. Yeah. yeah. Hi. Uh, I'm Jesse. Um, uh, I'm struggling theist. Um, uh, I've got 15 years sober in a 12 step program. Um, and is essential to sobriety in a 12 step program is the idea of a higher power. Um, yeah. And, uh, I've been having like, I don't know, like an existential crisis every day recently. Um, because I've been, I've been questioning, you know, like if, well, if there's no God or there's higher power, if there's no like reason or purpose to any of this, then like why stay sober? Because then ultimately it's just like, Love is just a chemical action. It's not a real thing. Why Chemicals stay faithful to my wife? Why not just last heroin and you know hook up with a ton of chicks and have fun till it all goes down? Um, so I always noticed that, really that people tend that, to, yeah. people tend to value most that which is rare, and what what is more rare than life, the, the few moments that you have. And while you will not live forever in heaven, fortunately, fortunately, you will not have to kiss mm -hmm. the colon of an inexplicably insecure demonic despot forever. Uh, there is the notion that whether there was a God or not, history will be your judge and your legacy will be in, in, the, in the memories of your loved ones. And that, for some of us, tends to matter. I have a question. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let me ask one thing real quick. Um, you said that uh, that the concept of a higher power is required to maintain sobriety. But if there is no higher power, how did you maintain your sobriety? Um. No. So I'm. I'm a. I'm not atheist. I'm a struggling theist for sure. Um, right. So well, let's say there and, is no higher that, power, because that's a conclusion. No, yeah, he, to, right? he's he's coming from the background. He believes there is a higher power. Sure, but let, you're, you see, you said you're struggling with it. You're faltering with it. You're trying to reckon with the notion that there may not be a higher power. So let's mm -hmm. say there is no higher power. How did you then maintain your sobriety in this time? Um, do a probably like a big ecological trip trick. I I, I honestly I don't know. Um, Doing the practicing you did it, the right? the principles within you. Yeah, yeah, really? something within me. But but the the the, the problem with that is I've I've not been able to. I haven't heard a satisfying answer from atheists or people that just reject like the notion of a higher power as to why that matters at all outside of my brain. Like it, it seems did utterly, I not just it, answer it, that. It, I, you, you did, but I mean, like, I, I don't know. It's, I, I, I could say that I value that, but then ultimately, that's like there's actually no value outside of that. But if you need to be told, I, I'm what a to little value, confused. How much value can it truly have? Do you want to be disrespected by the people you care about? Um, if, if there's no higher power, then I don't know that that disrespect means anything or that it's anything to be really worried about. Doesn't it I'm mean everything? Fighting some... If there's no higher power, doesn't, the, doesn't the people who, who love you mean everything? Right. Why would you want to alienate um, all of these people with terrible behavior? Right. Isn't that the, the, the thing that makes you happy having these relationships? It it might uh, I mean but 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 what is like I guess like ultimate like it's 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 just like I'm just kind of like blowing time until the lights go out at that point and like 
like well, you don't do my killing time. You could be using it wisely. You can do well, whatever look, you want. Let's, 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 let's hear him out. This is this kind of perspective. I think if he if he describes it long enough, he'll see his own flaw. Mm-hmm. Which is I I I don't know that I I don't know like I. If if ultimately the sun is going to swallow the earth in ten thousand or whatever billion five years or whatever, billion. like yeah, five billion. Oh, tight. Oh, so we got some time. Um, you and and I'm I'm not and I'm not trying to be, I'm 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 not trying to be disrespectful or or, or totally fine. You know anything like that? Like I, just, I'm just really trying to be honest in in the that like I, it it, it terrifies me if there's no higher power. Because then there's no ultimate meaning, and the meaning is just whatever I make up. And to me, that and and All so ultimately, outside of my brain, it's yeah, it's 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 not actually meaningful. No, but then it it's that's the here's it that is I'm meaningful. Free. It is only meaningful if it is truly meaningful to you, and not the external will of some deity uh, that needs for you to worship him, right? I've yeah, got a no, psychological and, and, and experiment. Yeah. I've got a psychological sure. experiment you might want to consider. Imagine that uh-huh. at the moment of your death, you find out that there's there's this thing that you you know when you that the, the old belief that your life flashes before your eyes, right? Well, imagine uh-huh. that all of your matter, all of your your accumulated knowledge, everything, allows you to live again in a moment before your body shuts completely off, before your brain completely shuts off that you can live your entire life all over again and you can do whatever you want. And whether or not there's a God in this, you'll, you'll feel like, you know, if, if you want to go back to when you were 14 or 18 or whatever, you get to live your whole life out and just, just have it all over again. It may only be happening in a few seconds, but you'll feel it as if it's 30, 40, 50 years, however long it was. But the thing is, one of the things you innately understand is that whether there's a God or not, you will not be judged. What you do with this in this relive of your life matters not. Uh-huh. Whether you're judged for your previous life, we don't know, you don't know. But you know that this relive counts for nothing. You get to do this however you want. And my thought is uh-huh. that most people, my I, my my thought, you you could get away with raping and murdering and just vandalizing everything. Nobody wants to do that. If you got to live this over again, I think most people, knowing what they know now, would be better people than they were the first time around, even when they don't have to be, even when it means nothing. Uh, yeah, and that may be, I don't know, the, the, the first thought that comes to my mind is I'd probably just to like a vigilante and just, you know, kind of why? give in to whatever. Be, How? Because why, why not? <laughs> like, because like, why? If I could just go around. The question like, was why? Because it would make not me why feel not? good. Because, okay, right, because right, it, it would make, it make good. you what feel good. To, what specifically does would it make, make you feel, feel good, good you to saying? cause people pain? Uh, is causing people pain, pain make you feel good. Do you mean vigilante? Like you would go like murder like horrible people and give them their comeuppance or what do you mean yeah. by vigilante mm-hmm. well, yeah you, do you know now. like um, you could do that even believing in god too what's the difference i could um there's there's thing to live for now i guess with my with my wife and like if there's some like i, I don't okay. to know the reason for why everything is here like i just need there to be a reason you know what i'm saying Oh. No, I don't. Yeah. But but here's the thing. You just said that you value your relationship with your wife, right? If there were not to be any higher power, why why do you why are you uh, uh, suggesting that the value in your relationship would somehow dissipate if there was no higher power, right? What you have with your wife, you have with your wife, whether or not there is a God. What's why would it change? I do, I do. I guess it would just change the quality of it to just like biological what? programming. I don't know, have you ever seen that? Uh, because it, because it would. Have, um, I think that's not an answer. I, I don't. I don't know. Because it would. 
what you yeah, have with your just, wife, you have, whether or not there is a higher power, right? You have yeah. that currently. Yeah. Now, if I and knew in advance, relationships do. What's that? If I knew in advance certain inju- certain injustices, and I knew the way to uh, to stop those injustices, and I had another chance to live again, I probably would. If I if I knew the details enough to to have an effect there. But being a vigilante, just mm. going out and hunting. I mean, I know there's no fucking Batman. That that doesn't work. That would that's not realistic. But it also has nothing to do with the belief in God. You can be a vigilante today, whether or when you believe in God or not. Right? I mean, I, I don't see how that has any correlation yeah. with belief in God or not. Look, you have relationships. Yeah, you have a relationship with your wife, you have a relationship with with friends, presumably. You have things of value in your life. And the, the, the value that you derive from that is not, is not an offshoot of your belief in a higher power. It just isn't. You could cease believing in a God today, and all of those things would still exist and continue to mean those things to you. 100%, right? There are people, I'm an atheist, and I, have, I value my relationship with my wife and my children, my friends, etc. And I behave in a way so as to maintain those relationships because they bring me joy, not because I'm expected to by a higher power or some other reason like that, right? These are, these are human sentiments that we all share and uh, has nothing to do with mm-hmm. God. At, at any point in my life, there was a time when, when I just, when I wanted to live in the moment when I didn't, life never had meaning. That's just a stupid question for me. And I just wanted to live for the sake of living. You know, I was a young, good-looking guy, and I'm having a great time, and that's all that life meant to me. But I didn't want to disrespect other people. I still want to be remembered fondly. I want to be respected myself. So I'm, I, while I was a bit of a dick because I was an ignorant prick, I didn't want to be a dick to other people, so I had to learn how not to be. You know, and, and I, I got over that. To large degree, I hope, because I was a real dick. <laughs> We've all hurt people's feelings before. I mean, yeah. You, you hopefully, yeah. as you get older, you mature and you do that less, right? But um, yeah, it's all internal, you know. Yeah. I try always to murder fewer yeah, no. people this year than I did last year. Yeah, because there's no God. You can do it, right? Well, <laughs> no, I mean. That, I mean, <laughs> laws are important. I think that murder should be illegal and that it should be uh, enforced to punish murderers, you know, but that's just human society. That doesn't right. But I guess that... to, what, to what to what end? What do you mean to, to what like, end? What, like what like what does what? that actually like what does that actually matter outside of? How, OK, here's here's right an now. important question. This you're, you're getting to something much more important. There is no God. There is only us. And we have to take care of each other. That's just, that's all that there ever was. So the reason that it matters is that we have to rely on each other to help each other, humans being humanitarian. But believers have this, if you don't mind my saying, perverse idea that, that they're going to d- defy death and they're going to, and, and for whatever, and that, Kissing the ass of an inexplicably insecure despot for all eternity somehow gives meaning to their lives. To me, it deprives all meaning. You're 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 going to put me in damnation. Right. You're going to put me in. You're going to put me trap me in the house with little Anthony Fremont, who can read my mind, and I better be thinking good thoughts. And he's going to do terrible things to me if I don't. I'm I'm not looking forward mm-hmm. to this. This doesn't give meaning to my life. If my if I exist for absolutely forever, my life doesn't mean anything anyway. We tend to, yeah. to, to value things that are rare. If it's always and forever, that is no value. It's yeah. the Religion moment that we live. Of its meaning, not the, not the It's converse, the moment yeah. that we live that matters. Um, yeah, no, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think any, like, I think I, if there is a God, it's definitely not what any of the religions describe, because it just doesn't make any sense if they're talking about, like, something eternal and, whatever gentlemen they apply all these human characteristics to it and you know it's it's absolutely stupid so i don't i I don't believe in any that at all um gentlemen we need to move on to super chats okay 
All right, and I know that uh, Mr. <laughs> Professor, Dr. David, <laughs> whatever the the, the the title is, uh, Farina needs to go. Dave is good. So, yeah. <laughs> okay. I will appreciate the conversation, right, so, fellas. Thanks for yep, calling in. I, I, good, I, as do we. One. So thank you very much. Hello, I'm Jimmy Snow, executive producer for The Line and avid candy eater. Hey, if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so now on Patreon or as a channel member with tiers specific to supporting specific shows and hosts. And it also supports our ability to expand programming going forward. You could also leave a super thanks down below, get a little special highlighted comment. And I'll tell you what, you could hit like and you could hit subscribe. Now, here are some video suggestions so we can fudge that algorithm. Go with one of ours. Forget everyone else on YouTube. I'm begging.